What's cracking, YouTube? It's your boy Double P back with another one for y'all. And uh, yeah, I'm back with another video as you can see. And if you read the title in the description, man, you already know what it is. I wind up running with the homie the game and uh, running some wreck with him. We do it every year, but uh, check it out. I wind up being in the park and I wind up running into another NBA player. It's actually Manute Bowe's son. So if y'all want to add him up, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? People who like to add celebrities or add uh, NBA players or maybe play park with them or something like that. Maybe he might add you back. Maybe he might play with you. Maybe he won't. But, you know what I'm saying? There goes Gamer Tag. If y'all on Xbox, go ahead and hit up my new bowl son, man. And tell him you want to run or something. You feel me? I actually tried to run with him, but I don't know if he was AFK or what. But he wasn't moving. But you see who walk in the wreck, man. My boy, the game. You see everybody got happy in the wreck dancing around. You know what I'm saying? Niggas happy because they finna run it up. No, we finna get a game in. And you see game, he averaging 28, almost 30 points. And he got a, a center build he running with. Usually every year, me and him be battling for like the first 99 slasher. He got me this year. I got him last year. He got me the year before that and the year before that. But I got him one year. You know what I'm saying? But uh, maybe two years. Because 18, I think I beat him too. 18, I think. Nah, 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 nah. I think he beat me again. But for the most part, we always battling for the first 99, uh, uh, at least the top overall with, with the slash and shot creator build because he make the same win every year. But this year, he got all kind of builds, man. He got like four five builds, a couple 99s. And uh, see me, I'm 97. I'm averaging a dub right here. I'm aver actually averaging more now after this video. But like I said, me and Game, we always run since 17. I've been running with Game, so... It's easy for him to send me an invite and want me to run with him or play with him or do whatever, you know what I'm saying? We run W's every time we run, you know what I'm saying? So, he been hitting me up since 17. We ran on 18 heavy. We ran on 19 a few times. And now we running again on 2K20. So, you can say the game is like one a cool nigga, man. Out of all the celebrities I know and all the niggas I know, game is a whole celebrity. And, you know, nigga hit me up to run games and... A lot of niggas I know that I really know be acting like they too good to run a game. That's what's crazy. And, uh, and gained millions and millions of fans and did millions of things and achieved so much coming from my city of Compton. He he played with me, you feel me? And I played with him just on the fact that we both catch W's when we running. As you can see, I'm at point guard, so game in the middle. So it's going to be easy. This game, the other team, they didn't have no skill set at all. We was running a 2-3 on them. So they couldn't really do nothing as in offense. We were just stealing the ball, passing it to each other, hitting threes. The other cast that we was running with from his from his clan TMC, shout out to them. You know what I'm saying? Because they definitely ballers too, just like game. They definitely ballers. They was making everything. I missed like three shots the whole game. I was mad about that. But for the most part, we was out there getting it. I'm just out there assisting the game. You feel me? Assisting to the other players. I was facilitating. For mostly the whole first half so i wasn't really scoring i was trying to get all the other stuff like as in steals as you can see and uh assist that's what i was mainly focused on getting the team points or getting niggas fouls like that so we can go to the free throw line and just just run the score up because i was at point guard but second half i, I kind of turned it up a little more but for the most part this game right here i just took it light on them and really just wanted the team to win because in, in 2K, even though you might be playing against a a, 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 a whack wreck team, bro, them, them, the game can actually cheese you and make them win. So I'm just taking it easy. You see them throwing me alley-oops. And as you know, my build is the mirror behind Michael Jordan, man. You see what your boy doing, man. I'm, I'm smaller this year. I'm so used to being 6'8 or like 6'10, man. It, it, being 6'6 six, six or 6'5 six, this year, bro, this shit is just crazy. But I'm, I see my dunks and it's, and it's crazy. My contact is more crazy than it was last year being 6'8". I couldn't do this stuff. So being 6'5 this year and I'm actually just dunking on fools crazier than I was at 6'8 last year just tells me that this game is kind of broke. Because I guess the shorter you make, the, the higher you can jump, which is stupid. Because I, I would believe the taller a nigga is, the easier it is for you to do these dunks. But on this game, the shorter you make your character, the higher he jumped, the more contact dunks he gets. So, I don't know why they did that. I think it's stupid for slashers to go down, have to go down just to be able to dunk. You go up higher, you can't dunk on nobody, which is stupid. But this is 2K, as you know. The game is still broken. still got glitches in the game. 
And uh, after the new patch, a lot of people saying the game is broke, but I, I love it. Look, man, your, your boy slashing crazy, like easy. Just my character is so fast now. I'm like 90, at least a 91 at speed, 91, 92. So I just run around people, bro. I don't even gotta, I don't gotta do too much dribbling this year. And if I do, I'm gonna take off with that first step. You feel me? But like I said, everybody on the team was cashing out, bro. If you're looking at the, the screen, you see everybody cashing out. I'm just trying to assist and get my assists up. And I still be trying to get rebounds. I don't know why, even though my rebound is like a 30. I'm not grabbing nothing in the rebounding area in the paint or nothing unless it just bounce off and come to me. I don't know why, but yeah, man. You see me assisting to your boy. Game throwing it up. I, that's the craziest little alley you like. Well, not alley, but layup animation. I didn't see in the game where they throw it up so high. But you see, we clamping, fast breaking, throwing it straight down, catching easy dunks. And if you don't know, fast break points is probably the easiest points in the game. So if you're a guard, you need to hurry up and get down there. You see me knock the ball out. I'm clamping him so bad that I wind up punching him real quick. You know what I'm saying? Just trying to get the ball. But I hate that. When you poke the ball out, you can't grab it. And then when you try to reach again, they just call foul. It's stupid because I should have had it the first time. Like this still right here. They throwing it back to us and we it's, it's just crazy. Like the game is still broke. Like I said, you get a steal, you give it right back. And look, I guess he was mad I fouled him. He hit me back. So gave me some easy free throws, you feel me? I take that. I take any free throws. I take any points in the, in the wreck. And one thing about wreck, they give you a lot of free throws if you go into the paint this year. So... I advise y'all to work on your free throws, get your greens at the line. A lot of fools be missing and you miss five, six free throws, then you lose by three points and wonder why you lost, bro. Some of the easy points you miss. But you see your boys fast breaking on to the next quarter. We wearing them out at this point. It's 56 to 41. They made a little run, but it wasn't too much of nothing because we wind up still keeping the lead. And you see me, I'm just trying to assist, throw it around the back, trying to get my boy game to work it up. And he wind up, he's so good with the with the center now that you see him. He started out from the three just faking him and wind up getting all the way to the paint faking him. But I was still scoring. And what's crazy is the dude, he, he going to try to do the same thing on him, but it, it just ain't going to work. That, that, I know that make a lot of people mad when somebody's centers. They be getting real mad when niggas score on them. They try to do the same thing to them and it just don't work. That should be looking like, look at this. He looks stupid. Look, they, they call timeout on this dumb ass. They called timeout on him, and he wind up couldn't even get a shot off, but he was trying to get game back, and it didn't even work. I'm dead. But uh, he wind up going right back to the paint again, right on him again, another easy layup. Like I said, we was running it up too easy. He know how I play. I know how he play. And it's just, look at the paint, man, wide open. It's like I didn't even have to pass. So most of the points I took is smart points. I didn't take no contesteds. The ones I did miss, I should have made. It probably was like an open corner. I don't know why I, I can't shoot open corners, but I really don't have the corner specialist badge, and I think that got a lot to do with it. But game, that's a crazy fast free throw he got. And look at this. I just ran in the paint. Intimidator. Bro, if you don't got Intimidator badge, look how key this is. I didn't even jump. I just knew when he went in the paint, I'm going to run under him so I can get that badge to light up. And look what happened. He missed it, and he probably wondered, how the hell did I miss that? Because I had Intimidator, you feel me? So a lot of times you be in the paint and you, you miss something. You be like, how the f did I miss that? It's because some idiot has Intimidator on the court. He probably was near you and he made you miss, bro. So if you don't got the Intimidator badge, I got it on bronze and it works like it's Hall of Fame. So I could just imagine the people with Hall of Fame. You are not going to make that layup on somebody who has Hall of Fame Intimidator. I don't care what your average is. I don't care what your overall is. If he get in there and get in place under you, you will not make that unless it's a green. That's it. But uh, you see us. You see us run it up. Your boys score a hella points. I have 14 on the board. See, game doubled up on us. Had the double-double. But all the TMC, shout out to y'all that ran with it. Shout out to y'all, bro. Look at the player of the game. You feel me? I had to do my aerobics. You feel me? On the court because I already knew it was an easy game. Trying to stretch out that hammy I caught earlier in like the third quarter. But yeah. Your boy caught the dub, and uh, anybody want to run with me and wreck, anybody want to play, hit me up. Make sure you, you know, like, comment, subscribe, and all that. Make sure you send me a message on Xbox. I'm looking for people to run with. And shout out to the game for even hitting me up to even run this game so I can post this video and make this content. But I got more content coming for y'all later. But I just dropped a whole new album today. Go look it up called 
130th in Compton Ave. Go look it up on Spotify, anywhere. Double P, 130th in Compton Ave. I'm Double P, the Compton General, and I'm out. Peace.